Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, loads of you asked me how did I manage to clear my skin and yeah I know I still have one intruder here but all the rest has cleaned up. I haven't shooted a video in quite a few weeks, I think there have been two weeks now because my skin was awful, awful and I didn't want to just talk nonsense and I waited for it to clear and then I'll be able what I told you what my skincare routine is and what you can try as well so due to me starting to use differin which I'm going to show you right now yeah due to this little man oh uh, my skin went crazy started to break out um for about two weeks no what I've been using it for four weeks now and my skin was awful when I'm saying awful I mean that spots one next to each other immediately as you can see the scars they were very close up one to each other and now even now I have some dry skin here and a bit yeah. over here um I'm going to start by saying that what saved me during the time of dryness, it was this ointment because it's very, 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 very greasy and it would stay and hydrate the skin for the entire day and obviously I wouldn't go anywhere out when I would I wear just it. start with my skincare routine because my morning routine is the main one the evening one, I'm just using niacinamide and differin, so it's not much to it. So in the morning, I'm using my savior, the unscrub. The unscrub is a very extremely gentle exfoliator, which has jojoba, jojoba beans in it. And it looks like this as a texture, it's a gel. And then I apply once here, once here once here a bit of warm water so i can just dissolve them and then i start to rub and then even if you have irritated skin or anything this is probably the most gentle thing that your skin is going to ever feel and you rub it in until the jojoba beans are perfectly absorbed as mine yeah and then I put a tiny bit of more water and then I go over here. See, that's how it looks like when you don't rub it in. And then after a while, you just rub it in. And then you go all over. And you keep rubbing it in until it's dissolved. Yeah. So this is the most important because it's providing an extra hydration treat. Yeah. See? absorbed now let's wash it and now that i've washed it i will carry on with the products that i am about to use and i will explain to you why am i using them and what type of results i've seen from using them okay so before probably in my first videos i used to use lots of products maybe i don't know seven at a time especially in the morning routine then i've realized that i don't really need as many and i'm going to just waste money waste products and i'm going to apply too much on my skin so then i've decided to cut it and then keep the essential ones so I couldn't, I'm not exaggerating, I couldn't live without my BHA from Paula's Choice. This has helped me a great, great deal because in the times when my skin is red or when um, it's just irritated, even when it feels perfect, I still need it because instantly calms down everything makes it nice, the texture feels nice. Love it. For me, BHA has been a life savior because it it just kept the, the, the skin in the same balance. 
it, it kept the skin nice. The salicylic acid from it probably prevent further break. Okay, so um, now I will try to use one of the Cosarex Pimple Master Patch in order to cover my spot and prevent further infection or just treat it, yeah? So I've took it, looks like this. Not entirely sure if you can see it. Then I'm going to apply it. And now that the patch has been applied, I have moved over from the mirror and the sink to where I'm going to present you the rest of the products that um, I'm using in the morning and that they are contributing to my flawless glowing skin. So the next step in the routine is the vitamin C serum. Now, with the vitamin C serum, I've been using it from uh, Timeless for quite a while because for me, it was simply the best. Now, yay! I won my first competition, my Polish choice. And um, I have won a full-size charcoal mask, a full-size 2% uh, BHA toner and um vitamin c serum now i've uh, tried the um, the clay mask but that's going to be in another video where i'm going to tell you all about it and um after the timeless is going to finish i'm going to start using their vitamin c which i can't wait but until we get there let me tell you why i haven't applied the patch at the end of the routine now this patch is very sensitive, has some tea tree oil in it, has some um, ingredients that they are fighting against the spot. The reason you have to, uh, to attach the patch on dry clean skin is because it needs to make the contact with your skin. If you have any other products that have been applied on it, you have different layers that is going to make harder for the patch to make contact is going uh, probably your skin is going to be a bit oily from the moisturizer or is not going to be the same as the clean if it's not going to be the same as if your skin would be clean and dry now using the vitamin C what I like is I like to just so at the minute it looks cloudy because it's fresh yeah so I just like to drop it three drops preferably and then just make sure that I blend it in the skin now I'm in most of the time I like to do a bit of massage but you should not touch the small pipe to the skin because if you do touch it you can contaminate your uh, your pipe and just two drops on the forehead and that's going to be enough for now. Now I allow the vitamin C to dry for quite a while. Most of the time it takes five minutes to fully absorb. And I like, in the morning when I have time, I like to uh, leave it to absorb quite, quite a while. When I have to go to work, I let it absorb maybe two, three minutes and then it's gone. But when, when I'm working from home or when I am home, I like to allow it for a bit more time. Now, after my uh, vitamin C, I used to have a small... Uh, let me double check if I still have it. Uh, yeah, after the vitamin C, I like to use the sample that I've got from Polish Choice for the Azelaic Acid Booster. It is really nice and this one in combination with your 2% BHA it's fighting better against your blemishes it's clearer the skin better it's improving the texture and it's, it's way much better if you're using them both together now I'm planning on buying the full size of it because it is really good and uh, yeah so it is recommended for the as a like acid to use it after the vitamin C. If you use it before the vitamin C, you're cutting the 
strength and the effect from the vitamin C and from the azelaic acid. If you use them the other way around, so BHA, vitamin C, azelaic acid, the third product, then that apparently is going to work better for your skin. Who am I to say no to the scientist, hey? Okay, so after I'm going to use the azelaic acid, as I said, at the minute I'm going to let it dry, so I'm not going to keep you and I'm just going to move on with the products that I'm going to be using. After azelaic acid, I'm going to use the Timeless B5 Hydration Serum. This is a serum that contains nothing, nothing else but water, vitamin B5, hyaluronic acid, benzyl alcohol, and dehydrochetic acid, whatever that means. But the list of the products is not big. Hop, 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 hop. Anyways, this is the one from here. You can't really see because today is such a sunny day that everything is just... The sun is there. Anyways, so after the hydration serum, I like to apply it. It's in a very odd order. But I like to apply after that my, uh, my Polish Choice Ceramid Eye Cream. Now I have this sample for a month, even if not more than that, and it's, it's just amazing. So this one I can even apply it now actually, because it doesn't really matter the order. So it has retinol and it's just amazing. So it has like a yellowish color and I like to put a bit here and a top here. And then just, I like to massage it into the skin and I love it. But this is bloody expensive, however, I promise to myself that I'm going to buy it when this sample is going to be over because it's simply just amazing. It's so good to the point that not only that it feels really, really hydrated, but in my point of view, my dark circles have brightened a bit and I used to have dry skin under the eyes and now that seems to, to be gone, so I like, I don't know if you've noticed, but in everything I do on my skin or my eyes or anything, I like to do a massage, so uh, that's why you're going to see me there, oh, that's massage for me. So after that, I will use my Omega Complex Moisturizer again from Polish Choice. Now, the reason that I have a sample again, it's purely because I have tried different moisturizers from her to see which one fits my skin better at which time. And Omega Complex Moisturizer is helping my skin in the times with Differin. And then I have purchased from Costarex um, green tea gel type moisturizer that it's coming from yes style and i think i don't know if it's made now from korea but i swear to god it takes ages i think i have three weeks three bloody weeks since i bought it and it's not even now here i'm like are you going to bake it now what on earth are you doing never mind that and uh, the last step is my always and forever favorite sunscreen, the one from Murad. This is my favorite sunscreen. It's uh, SPS 50 with four pluses on the PA and it's just amazing. I love it. It's helping. It never broke me. It doesn't leave a cast and it's simply the best for me. Now guys, thank you very much for watching. If you have any other questions, please let me know, just to let you know that my moisturizer is going to change uh, to the one from Cosarex as soon as I'm going to, to receive it. And also I'm going to uh, start using a new sunscreen the second that it arrives as well. I even forgot the name because I bought it so long ago. Now, thank you very much guys for watching. If you have any questions as usual, just please drop a comment below. And if you like it, share it. If you don't like it, just don't say anything. Don't do anything. And uh, thank you very much, guys, for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. And the only reason I'm doing these videos is because I enjoy talking to the camera, thinking that someone is on the other side of the camera listening to me and saying, hmm, yeah, 
I would like to do that or yes I have the same problems as she does and I'm going to do this because her skin looks marvelous thank you very much guys have a good day bye